Hi friends, good evening and welcome to my channel Mukambiga Nursing. Friends, today again we can see some another set of questions from previous question paper. We will see the question one by one. First question, abnormal sensitivity of light is known as. And the options are option A, hydrophobia, option B, diplopia, option C, aphasia, option D, photophobia. Question is abnormal sensitivity of life. Light. It is an easy question. So here answer is option D. Photophobia is the correct answer. Photophobia means abnormal sensitivity to light is known as photophobia. Hydrophobia means fear of water mainly seen in case of rabies and diplopia means double vision aphasia means is a disorder of communication our question is abnormal sensitivity of light is known as photophobia option d is correct answer we will see the next question the second question the rate of drug absorption is greatest in Options are option A large intestine, option B stomach, option C gallbladder, option D small intestine. Here question is the rate of drug absorption is greatest in which part of the stomach? That is the question. So here answer will come option D small intestine is the correct answer. That is maximum absorption of drugs and nutrients takes place in small intestine so most of the drugs and nutrients are absorbed in the small intestine why the small intestine means the presence of villi and microvilli in the mucous membrane of small intestine greatly increases the surface area okay so the maximum portion of nutrients and drugs are absorbed in small intestine okay maximum and mineral salt this is important point mineral salt and vitamins and some water and some drugs are absorbed through large intestine so large intestine mineral salt vitamin and some portion of water and some drugs are absorbed in large intestine okay so most of the nutrients and nutrients and drugs are absorbed in large intestine and this gallbladder option c gallbladder is not a part of alimentary tract it is an accessory organ of digestion so here answer is option d third question superficial edema and bruising in the subcutaneous fatty tissue around the umbilicus is known as Options are option A, Stolworthy sign, option B, Cullen sign, option C, Spalding sign and option D, none of this. Here question is superficial edema and bruising in the subcutaneous fatty tissue around the umbilicus is known as, is one of the characteristic features of Cullen sign. Option B is correct answer. So Cullen sign and Turner sign are the characteristic features of acute pancreatitis. So here answer is option B, Cullen sign is correct answer. And Stalworthy sign is mainly seen in case of placenta previa. Stalworthy sign in placenta previa and spalding sign is usually seen in intrauterine death. Okay, so cooling sign is seen in cooling sign means superficial edema and bruising in the subcutaneous fatty tissue around the umbilicus is one of the characteristic features of one of the sign of acute pancreatitis. Fourth question: Which of the following is used to assess the level of consciousness? And options are option A, Abga score, option B, Braden scale, option C, Glasgow coma scale, option D, Snellen chart. See here, question is, which of the following is used to assess the level of consciousness? Level of consciousness is usually assessed by Glasgow coma scale. Option C is correct answer. Okay, level of consciousness is mainly in unconscious patient and all level of consciousness is assessed by Glasgow coma scale. One of the neurological examination. Okay, and options a apgar score apgar score is used to 
us as the condition of newborn at the time of birth that is abgascore and braden scale is used to assess the pressure ulcer risk okay for pressure ulcer braden scale is used and abgascore is used to for assess the newborn and snell chart is there snell chart is used to assess the vision of eye here level of consciousness is used to assess by glasgow scoma scale option c is correct answer next question fifth question b lunch sutures is used in it's an important question options are option a postpartum hemorrhage option b hysterectomy option c episiotomy option d antepartum hemorrhage a question is b lunch suture is used in postpartum hemorrhage option a is correct answer it's an used in postpartum hemorrhage next question the equipment used in examination of ear or options are option a laryngoscope option b ophthalmoscope option c otoscope option d proctoscope here question is equipment used in examination of ear is otoscope okay otoscope is used to examine the ear okay and laryngoscope laryngoscope is used to visualize the larynx and proctoscope option d proctoscope is used to visualize rectum and ophthalmoscope is used to visualize fundus of the eye here question is equipment is to used in used in examination of ear is otoscope option c is correct answer seventh question a child can draw a complete triangle at options are option a 2 years option b 3 years option c 4 years option d 5 years here question is a child can draw a complete triangle at the age of that is the question so correct answer is option d 5 years is the correct answer by 5 years a child can draw a complete triangle and related points we can see by 12 to 24 months a child can scribble that is child can use dot dot and all by 12 to 24 month and by 2 years a child can draw vertical and horizontal line so a child can draw vertical and horizontal line by 2 years and by 4 years sorry by 3 years child can draw a circle and by 4 years a child can use plus sign or rectangle by 5 years a child can draw triangle okay for 2 years child can draw vertical and horizontal line 3 years circle 4 years rectangle rectangle or plus sign and 5 years triangle here question is triangle by 5 years option d is correct answer next question eighth question simple test widely used in india for the diagnosis of kala azhar is and the options are option a antigen test option b cb nat test option c land probe as a option d aldehyde test of napier here question is which test is used in india for the diagnosis of kala azhar for the diagnosis of kala azhar widely used test in india is aldehyde test of napier option d is the correct answer this is also one of the important question so the test widely used simple test widely used in india for the diagnosis of kala azhar is option d aldehyde test of napier this kala azhar is mainly caused by an organism that is leishmania donovani donovani is the causative organism for kala azhar leishmania donovani and the incubation period of this kala azhar is 1 to 4 month 1 to 4 month this kala azhar is also known, also known as black sickness so black sickness is kala azhar these are some related points about kala azhar here option d is correct answer Next question the ninth question streptomycin antibiotic was discovered by 
options are option a alexander fleming option b oxman option c frangel option d nasal here question is streptomycin antibiotic was discovered by option b oxman the antibiotic streptomycin was discovered by s a oxman and our option alexander fleming is there sir alexander fleming was discovered by penicillin okay penicillin was discovered by alexander fleming and frangel one option is there frangel who discovered pneumococcus pneumococcus bacteria was discovered by frangel and option d is there nasser nasser who discovered gonococcus gonococcus was discovered by nasser here our question is streptomycin antibiotics was discovered by option b waxman next question 10th question hypersensitivity phenomenon was discovered by options are option a louis pasteur option b robert koch option c alexander fleming option d nature here question is hypersensitivity phenomena was discovered by so answer is option b robert koch is correct answer hypersensitivity phenomena was discovered by robert koch and louis pasteur is there louis pasteur is father of microbiology and also louis pasteur introduced the process of sterilization technique and the development of live actinated vaccine all louis pasteur and also the term vaccine was given by louis pasteur and development of rabies vaccine by louis pasteur all louis pasteur okay related to louis pasteur and here hypersensitivity phenomena was discovered by robert koch and alexander fleming alexander fleming penicillin was discovered by alexander fleming as we already saw in the previous question and nature nature also we saw in previous question that is gonococcus was discovered by nature here our question option b is correct answer